Hello everyone. Uh, my name is Yatish Kuril, founder of Kuril, founder of B School. So I would like to welcome you all, and to everyone, I would say that I would like to say that good morning, good evening, good afternoon, from wherever you are watching. Uh, today we are going to present uh, Professor Evgeny Bachov. He is a professor in the area of leadership and coaching. So today we are going to talk about overview about the, the program. And so that you can understand what we are going to teach and what will be the takeaway and how you can build up capability and uh, grow yourself, develop your skills and capability along with the learning. And in addition to say, in addition to this, I can say that we also have uh, uh, real life, real life uh, simulations game where you can uh, practice and learn about challenges what you are going to face in future. It will be easy for you to handle the situation. So uh, let me uh, uh, welcome uh, Professor Evgeny. Good evening. Hello. Yeah, so uh, before, yes, yes. before we begin, uh, I would like to uh, request to introduce yourself and uh, take over the uh, screen. Uh, yes, hello. Good to see everyone. Uh, I am Evgeny. Bajor of uh, coaching and leadership in Kuril Founders Business School. This uh, is in a Russian Academy of Economics and also lecturer in Chinese uh, University of Oil and Gas uh, in the Faculty of Israel. Uh, in my history, I am eight years experience from the positions from translator when I was young, he was a CEO officer and, and the turnaround, uh, annual turnaround of the company was 300 million years ago. I have seven years experience of, of uh, 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 entrepreneurial as a business company and uh, this annual turnaround was 1 million US dollars. Uh, uh, since to be involved in uh, education and, and coaching, I'm a fan of this is is what make people really achieve their full potential about it. If uh, athlete at the peak of a body form, uh, like Olympic athlete, have a coach and have one to achieve the highest possible results in his career and in so this is passionate. Uh, me by myself to see the, the possible talents develop to the most highest level. And that's what I'm doing since 2016 as a mentor, coach, and a professional consultant in companies. Uh, coaching background, I PCC by ICF, International Coaching Federation, and, and also I am uh, executive by and several other organizations. Uh, currently um, finishing my PhD research in psychological management. So uh, that's what I see that, that uh, business, that all relationships, they're managed by not by companies, not by governments, by us, by humans. So how, how to communicate? How, how to, to find those best things inside of the human and how to see those matching between people. That's what passion coaching and about the life itself. Uh, Yatish, could you... Professor Yatish? Let's see uh, the slides. Mm, hope we will see them fast and... Oh, okay. uh, it's all about leadership and coaching, and today we, we discuss um, how to lead business in new area, in the area which we will see. And uh, um, you already, uh, uh, I'm sure you see the 
those many big uh, please next slide if you boost your revenues or you are looking to switch careers and be, or, or maybe you want to supplement your current salary I will give you a complete and what to do expect today we will discuss what is why more and more companies hire coaches what coaches get what you will receive in the course and to the course short intro about me you can see on the slides and information which i gave to you previously next slide please let's discuss topic. what is coaching exactly uh, at its very core coaching is a step into the full potential by asking the right questions to help the client find the appropriate answer within themselves all the answers answers by uh, understanding is already in you because whatever things as a consultant as a manager does it work sometimes yes sometimes not because what i can it does not mean that you are able to do this because you have your own experience you have your understanding and you have your own situation around you and your company this is the difference precisely inside of your situation inside of your company situation. this is what coach is doing uh, next slide please uh, on the course when you join it there will be 30 percent and 30 percent of practice under supervision we are practicing you learn by doing you will be a ready-made professional it was already long in 80s uh, was identified that most of the uh, is traditional in traditional universities is already outdated because people think like only 10% of what they heard from professor it doesn't matter what they have very good students or not, not very good students they will remember only maximum 10% even lower because people the best version to learn about human beings so uh, when you, you uh, if you want to, to achieve better results you can learn from your peers but again it will only up to 25 percent and the best learning is learning by doing during the course of coaching and leadership you will be mostly focused on doing it with your peers and with your teams Next, uh, dear friends please uh, please uh, have a look around you uh, what kind of how many of them do you trust you want to follow Yatish, next slide, please. Different examples of leadership around the globe. Some of them we can't trust. Some of them say what's going on inside the company, right? When you go to the company, we we'll see different types of leaders. And uh, please, teachers, it will be our whole work assignment, which you will. Uh, whom do you see? Who are those people? There are several types of leadership, autocratic leadership, and uh, some more mixture of what do you see there and how can you identify uh, who are them? Do it. And uh, tell me in the uh, end of our, why do you think it's important to understand? Who is in front of you? What type of leadership of leader in front of you? And by which who is who? And uh, is it possible knowing what in front of you? Is it possible?
Facebook to find a way how to manage them. For, for example, not only because of your power of your position as a manager who is subordinate, but what if you are subordinate? Can you manage your leader? Thank you. And uh, next slide, please. On the course, you will learn different styles of leadership and how to identify the one and build cooperation based on the type of a leader in front of you. Important and very interesting uh, areas of, of development. Uh, why it's important? Toxic boss kills the, the atmosphere and the company lose. They need the company. It's simple. And company lose money. Why? As it is competition. Uh, toxic behavior leads to this and you can support between between different uh, managers really kills the company. I'm sure you have seen such situations in your companies and around you and uh, country governments. Next, next slide, please. In price to be competitive, company needs best people and good atmosphere of support to be able to work at full speed. Uh, this is American statistics that 84% of American workers said management makes them think about living in the company. And that after company losing low position worker, the new worker which will will have uh, to spend maybe three to five months uh, efficient and professional and company uh, loses almost 50 percent of to educate this person but if you're talking about the manager or the ceo 100 to 500 percent of his annual salary which company seeing for the talent uh, giving him extra salary, uh, payments for uh, headhunting companies, and then when this uh, boss joins the company, CEO or CTO or CEO or whatever, C level person joins the company. Six to eight months for this CEO or C level position, uh, uh, men start working at full speed. Company lose a lot of money. Uh, next slide, please. And uh, uh, stories which happened in China. Uh, and I, I was a witness when one manager, he was a representative of European company in China. He was a toxic boss. He was afraid to del deliver him uh, as he thought they don't cope with the manufacturing timing. And he was trying trying to avoid this uh, difficult conversation. So he only uh, could do nothing to save the situation. So they, they got the final US dollars because it was a fast fashion company. Uh, another situation in China, uh, uh, e-commerce director, she had tensions marketing they could not uh, confirm the style for new products packaging so there is just because they did not uh, communicate with each other well uh, behavior or way of thinking of another man one, one of the colleague please uh, write to me have you any kind of like this situations in your life, in your companies, maybe in your school or maybe in your company which you are working for, maybe in your family, even in the family. Next slide, please. And, and imagine one thing, because, uh, uh, it, because of the situations and leaving the company and uh, because strong strong uh, 
health position managers, they couldn't work in toxic situations. They need support. They want to develop their business but because of toxic bosses. They're leaving companies. So only that, and uh, uh, they keep working, but uh, because of weak, uh, keep uh, weak people to deliver good results, especially in the crisis, especially in the downturn. Uh, next slide, please. And when people say anything, just think about one thing. Imagine you are the boss of the provincial, uh, no visitors, no, no money, boring life. And you were to hire someone like Amir Khan in India. What do you think? Will you have any problems? Next slide, please. Yes or no? That's what is important. Could save your business. Team of good talents can skyrocket the company. As a manager, please do remember this. As a, uh, please do remember this. When you develop your own skills, you become more person. And coaching skills is uh, one of the what one of the because it's changed the whole, whole company culture, it's changed whole, whole your side. Uh, next slide, please. And uh, your coach, your role as a coach would involve a three approach approach to you. Number one is guidance to help. Clients eliminate negative obstacles and pursue constructive goals. Two is empowerment. The self worth and affirm their self belief. And number three, to improve their strategies in achieving their goals. And let's talk about the most interesting part. Right? right? Coach in how is that issue? The more experienced you are as a coach, the more famous. And this is what is really amazing in this profession. In most of the uh, professions, what's happening? You become the high chance they will get rid of you. Yakish, next slide. So, uh, with the uh, skills of co the more older you become, the more experience you become. Experience comes with time you spend in the profession. The more experience you become, the more higher the higher income you you have uh, by yourself. You of you as a coach going up, up, up exponentially. Having this skill in your arsenal, your lifelong success. That's what really amazing me. Next slide. Of course, there are certain skills that will help you succeed as a coach. And we will practice them during the class, during our program. Uh, and understanding of coaching frameworks. And theories of also learn. Uh, plus the ability to apply them practically with your highly developed in, in listening, observation, and communication skills. Also develop this in, in practice. The ability to take an empathetic and not towards your clients because we don't judge. You will practice with your peers to discuss clients. The person he or she could become in potential to inspire clients while retaining the right to challenge them for occasion. You will learn the role model attitude. You will become a role model yourself. Skills to manage the client base and related paperwork. I have specially uh, spreadsheets, contracts, and coaching journals which you couldn't only for uh, Google business founders business school. Standing of online advertising, networking skills, 
videos for spreading the word of your business, marketing and sales skills. The coaches who love to treat it like a business, please do remember this. You must think like an entrepreneur, business owner, of course. Marketing and sales are essential skills you need to develop as a coach during the course. It will be your graduation work to launch the project in your organization. And I will be glad to share all my knowledge and business owner as an entrepreneur and a corporate worker with you. How I am doing it in my coaching career and in my coaching practice. I have many hours of coaching practice and my clientele base is a corporate management from Fortune 500 list of companies and business SME, small and medium enterprises. So this is my area of focus. Uh, check different areas of uh, where you can purchase. Uh, next slide, please. After graduation, you need to change the job. Here are some areas where you can work as a freelance but please do remember as a freelancer what about working hours you there is no one who will decide for you you will decide how much do you want to work what via which channels do you want to work whether online whether offline whether group training etc many options and it's all up to you you will if you will work Work in the company, it's also similar situation. You will be uh, internal client, how to implement coaching, where, where to meet, and uh, career planning with recruitment agencies. What work uh, to broad your areas of where you can implement coaching. Companies with your internal companies. As an internal uh, outside with outside companies, team building, right? Personal issues like staff relationships, communication, productivity, life coaching, etc. It's all up to you. As a effective coaches, too, they need coaching sometimes to realize and achieve their own goal. They have several cases like this where other very successful coaches and me to help them in their issues and this is one niche to focus on next slide please and, and why companies hire coaches what's the purpose there is more growing practice among uh, uh, fortune 500 Listed companies think they are rich, but they are rich because they are investing in the best people. What they see, they see a return on investment uh, 500 to 700. Why? Because people like to be developed, developing, and leaders need to be nurtured. Nurture results for your company to grow and to get higher and higher revenue. It's change of the mindset, growing mindset. That's what in the company is. And you as a coach will get, you have all the knowledge and skills to develop other people's talents and help other companies to develop their talent. USA is uh, country number one. Because the uh, human potential development uh, as a country follows, so it and it will also grow the and widespread worldwide. Uh, next, next slide, please. Uh, why companies build co coaching con uh, culture having more and more better results? This is what they achieve and delivering new, new results. Uh, there are more and more satisfaction uh, in the job, conflicts, 
Uh, you remember in the beginning of the slides when we see those conflicts which are to the companies? So this will be reduced by the, the, uh, for 50%. And there are many, many bonuses which are kind of human potential development. Next slide, please. Here I want to share stories of several uh, students who were uh, uh, in uh, college. And uh, one client just recently told me the story of him that uh, corporate and uh, he was working very hard, very steady. He tried his best to get be to be promoted and to get uh, appreciation for that. He was only criticized, he was only punished and uh, was unhappy with his work. He always wanted more and, and saying that he is doing very bad. The guy was really, really uh, trying hard. After he, he after six months and he was implementing coaching skills he learned in, inside his uh, boss, same career, same, same position, but only 30% compared to what he worked before the work, work loss uh, in the beginning. He will be fired. But for his surprise, what happened? Surprising him. The boss uh, started uh, saying that he is uh, doing very well. Uh, workers uh, should really. Uh, help him and should learn. And by the way, he, he uh, find uh, and uh, hire assistant to this person and promotion. This uh, uh, Mister yeah, his name. He said it's a. He was so fascinated uh, with what he, he get and what he implemented. Another example uh, was an IT guy. His name is Valery. Uh, he was his own. IT company, startup, he failed, uh, uh, lost, uh, lost, he uh, joined coaching program, he thought about to become a coach. Then a uh, job in IT accelerator, and, and uh, he became a coach. But in IT industry, startups, IT startups. And guess who won? It was a win of startup companies and start, start Startup companies uh, gave him shares at companies. Now he's a very wealthy person. He communicates with very interesting, dominant, and uh, booming industry in IT sector. So, think about it. next slide, please. And this story I like a lot. And uh, that guy, he started really from the deep hole. He was uh, just a teacher in uh, China, uh, not native English speaker. He, he's Russian English uh, like three years ago in Chinese, really kindergarten with his laws. Uh, he borrowed some money and uh, learned coaching program and implemented in his life, in, in his work. What happened? Only after one year after implementing those life, uh, he changed his mindset. He became an entrepreneur in area. He wrote a book. You can find it uh, in Amazon and online. Uh, he became a, a partner in internet in Shanghai. Shanghai is the uh, most prominent uh, city in China. Those uh, international school bosses they invited him because he. He brought knowledge and to this uh, uh, international school, and, and uh, now even uh, Alibaba International School of Alibaba Group uh, uh, sales for teaching in classes. For him, this is amazing. He also launched project and uh, even uh, such thing as a science breakfast, that deliver some interesting results. Uh, you can uh, search it on online. His results are fascinating. Fascinating approach. He is uh, my super star. Uh, next slide, please. Now I 
I want to are uh, my mentors because when you want to learn something, it's always go to the roots and understand is it something new or it's based on the case. So my mentors, it's a uh, Marshall Goldsman. He is the number one in the world in leadership uh, among uh, thinkers. 50 number one by you in the world. It's a worldwide renowned thinker uh, in leadership. And another one is Gary Ranter by Forbes and Financial Times. He was among five in leadership. And psychologist and psychiatrist, worldwide famous. Uh, he's a academician, academic, and, and uh, he, he uh, is my. Teacher. And next slide, please. And uh, you can see books I have authored, and we still have some time to discuss have any questions. Now you can ask me something, and uh, uh, you can write those answers. Uh, what do you think? Identify the leader uh, in between of you. And how to manage the leader? Do you have any answers there? Hello, oh, yeah, questions? Any answers? Yeah, no, no, nobody is asking question right now. So what I can we can do is uh, since the broadcast is live in the LinkedIn, Facebook, and uh, YouTube. The people, uh, student, aspiring students who are looking to uh, developing their skills in the area of uh, leadership and coaching, may uh, look look into this video and uh, write to us, or they can visit to Quill Founder B School website in the Facebook, in or they can join group in the YouTube, or they can join into LinkedIn profiles. Uh, sorry, LinkedIn uh, group of Quill Founder B School, and they can leave the comments there, and uh, we may get back to you as early as possible. So uh, I thanks Professor Eugenie for uh, sharing, sharing his uh, insights about the program. And I hope uh, the people, uh, students who uh, really serious and would, would like to develop the capability may uh, write to us for an inquiry and we can get, uh, you know, share the details about the program. Also, we are coming up with a series of uh, uh, programs with the various uh, distinguished professors around the world from the world, I will say that. And uh, you may just watch us or uh, follow or subscribe us or follow us so that you can get more information about these programs. Thank you very much. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, yes, I am uh, eager to hear your questions and uh, you are free to if you have any questions about the program or about enrollment or about uh, uh, just write to me or just uh, write to the Kuyo uh, Founders Business and, and uh, see you there. I will be happy to share with you my knowledge and prosperity.